Hello, welcome to my binder collection. I also collect Red Velvet and Henry Lau, but those collections are small. Down this one. So, we got the light stick sets. Really expensive. It was like a dream come true when it arrived to my house because it took more than two months to be delivered. I was so happy when I saw it in my mailbox. And then we have this postcard set. I was so happy when they restocked them because they are from the pretty good era. Love them. And then we have this one from the do -do -do -do. But actually, I have there is one era before this, like the ACP2 last era. I got the postcards, but they are too big. They are really long, so they don't fit in my two pocket sleeves. So I need to buy more pages. That's okay. And then we have these holo Christmas cards. I love them, but they are from really different eras. So I just put them in the your eras. I don't know. I feel like they are more organized in that way. And then we have this is one of my favorite cards. Of this Coca Cola Jisoo selfie. I I am so invested on that card. I really invest a lot too. I just love it. I like antiquars a lot, so it makes sense. And then we have the Jenny Solo era that I bought when they restocked them last year. Oh, I started collecting in 2020. For example, this 2019 collect welcoming collection was so difficult to find. So I was really happy when I got them in a really fair price. And then we start with the Kill This Love era. I love this era a lot. I just wish that they gave us a uh, don't know what to do MV. Please YG. It was a really good song. Oh, this is my attempt to collect all these cars. I'm almost done, but I take my time. I am like a really relaxed collector. <laughs> and we have... Oh, I remember these, like the red cars. They hand us with those pictures. I'm blonde Jenny. I don't know when it's gonna be blonde. <laughs> I wish it was true. They play with my heart. <laughs> and we have these that I bought it just one week before they restocked it. So I was a bit sad, but still. Oh, and this is the Monopoly. So I never planned to buy it, but I just one day thought it would be fun to have a game from Blackpink. I have played it twice, I guess. Really fun. I have no regrets about that. <laughs> it's just a really fun thing to have in my collection. One thing that happens to me also many times is that when I bought a car and it never arrived like for example this, like I I have bought the other clear PC but I have never arrived to my house, sadly. And then we have these that are the spring collection. I love the backgrounds from the list. And this is how the leaves are photo book. Really expensive to get, but that was good that they restocked them. I bought it when they restocked them. They were really pricey, but it's really good for photograph reference. Um, like all the other albums, they are really good for photography. And we have How You Like That Era that we are still in. I want more songs from them, but I guess it takes time.
you have the summer diary in Seoul cars I just bought the regular version like the DVD version I wish I had though the kid version just to have the other Oscar set but I mean it's good it's good I have this one I mean but I would like to have the other one too and then oh more of the Christmas cards I really like the Christmas cards they're really colorful because of the color I just like them these are more of the album pieces as you can see, I also got the playing card set. <laughs> I have played with those two. Really cute cards. I like the holo that they put on the letters and the numbers. They're really cute. Really cute to play with them. I just wish we have another comeback soon. Hopefully before, or maybe right after the uh, anniversary. What do you think, guys? Put in the comments. We wanna come back. Please, please wait. Um. Well, this is it for this binder. I have another binder because this one started to get really heavy. So this is the second binder. In which I hold my next part of my backing collection. And we start with the Target exclusive. I like it a lot. I also have the Binley's, the LP's, but those cards don't fit here. <laughs> they are way too big. They, I, I keep them in their storage. Oh, and then we have the Welcome Collection of this year. Really cute to see. And now we we'll start with the show. When they released this, I bought the sticker set that came with the Jisoo pieces. But I never imagined that YG will bring us a DVD and exclusive limited edition cars. I never thought about it, so. Well, I mean, I don't complain. Cute pictures. But uh, please YG, just release everything at once because your shipping is really expensive for my budget. They're really cute. Um, I cannot storage all of the pictures like the A4 are still in my album because they are really big and I don't have pages for these. And then Right after the show was Roses solo, so I put this here. Um, I really like the stickers on her solo and the scrapbook theme. That was really unique. I really love that. I just got the limited edition photo books. I put these ones here. This is from a goal that I was part of. That was really cute. This is from the kids. I just like the roses solo. I mean, look at it. Like the style is really unique, really fresh. And, uh, and I also like that she put her dog hand in some of her pictures. I found it really cute. And then after the solo, I feel like it was Lisa photo book. The version of this year, the second photo book. I like it a lot. Oh, and I was able to fit all these in one page. I mean, we do what we can with these pages. And then uh, I think that's it for blacking. Yeah. Let's start with red velvet. I bought this binder because it reminds me of the members' colors. I wish my collection was bigger because I mean, it's red velvet. Come on. And I just missing the velvet and the day two regular version. But the thing is that I normally buy 
my albums and my photo card together so I always try to find the album and the Suji pieces so that's why my collection is mainly Suji and since I started collecting last year it was really hard to find everything I might say so this is a good accomplish but I'm still missing a lot of of the photo cards, postcards and stuff, but I would it would take long anyway. So uh, I also like to put the stickers. I have some obsession with that. I just like to set them like this is the page of the stickers and stuff. I don't know, I feel it's nice to see them. And then have this oh the finale. I never thought I will complete this era. But I mean, I'm happy. It feels like an accomplishment for my collection. Sadly, all the finale photocards and postcards are really expensive, but at least I was able to get all the tickets. I feel that they are really cute. And then we got the Monster Era, the first era, and my first comeback with Red Velvet as a collector. <laughs> So I was happy with it. Oh, and they also have a lenticular. I love lenticular, so I was really happy. I wish I had the other two. Maybe in the future. And we got more of the postcards. I mean, I was lucky to get Soji because I bought random albums expecting either of two. Oh, and I'm also so happy that Red Velvet will come back soon. It will be my first comeback as a group. Then we have the Wendy solo. So lovely. Her voice. Her voice is so lovely. The Joy solo. Hello. And that will be it with my Red Velvet collection. It isn't much. I hope it grows in the future. But I'm happy with it. And then lastly, we have Henry Lau. So he will be like my first bias in this K-pop industry. I have a stamp here for a long time. I feel like this collection is almost complete because he doesn't have as many photo cards as you could expect. Um, there is some cards that I'm missing that there will be like the old different versions of his album like the Japanese Taiwanese version uh, but this is pretty much done this is the journey era and then my Pokemon cards that I don't collect but I have and then that will be it for this video if you like it please give it a like subscribe to this channel we are really small bye